Hi everyone. Quick friendly reminder, July 15th, 2023, we're hosting the Fisherman's Life Street Fair at Stonestown Galleria from 10 to 5, open to the public. We're looking for vendors though, so if you want to be one or you know someone who might want to be one, contact me, link is in the description, or email me at info at fishermanslife.net. For all of you that might be attending, 20% off everything Fisherman's Life that day only. Uh... Now back to the video. It's a good one. I think it's a fun one, at least in my opinion. Peace. All right, June. Let's go, let's, let's do it, go. let's do it. We got some herring. I'm gonna thaw some off right now. Just throw this in there. I feel like we can get a couple. We're gonna limit today, bro. What are you talking about? Come uh, on. Yeah, I'm changing my <laughs> fishing mentality actually because <laughs> you, I used to just fish for one fish to make a video, maybe two, but now I'm gonna try to get limits almost every time. So feed my family, you know, pack the fridge, pack the freezer, you know? Might as well, right? We're out here, we might as well get our food. It's not a joke. Uh, why are you laughing? <laughs> yeah, we gotta have to feed our family. I got four kids. Yeah, exactly. Money doesn't grow on trees. First thing we're gonna do, we see a lot of boats straight ahead, so we're gonna drive over to them and kind of keep a little bit of distance just so we can see if there's any nets flying. June fish on. <laughs> yeah. We're just talking about maybe changing speeds to keeper. That looks like a keeper to me. Oh, for sure, keeper. Yeah, yep. keeper, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> First fish. Yeah. Anchovy, huh? Anchovy. Anchovy. Rainbow anchovy. anchovy. <laughs> Let's nice, go. Nice. Yeah, first fish on the deck. Okay, well then, I might have to change to the anchovy. Let's see if June gets another one. Oh. And if he does, then I'll switch to the anchovy myself. All right, only been fishing for about 10 minutes so far. Just gonna bleed it in the bucket. Woo! All right, feels good to get a fish on the boat. Yep, yep. All righty, drop this down back there. Let's go. See this spin first. Perfect spin. What does your spin look like? It's like... <laughs> kind of wide? Wide, wide spin. Let's put this on ice, yeah? And I'm gonna try to slow us down a little yeah. bit. All right, Matt is tying the bucket. And, uh, cause uh, we're, we're trolling a little faster, so we're gonna go a little slower. But using the bucket, it just slows us down. Well, I'm gonna try something a little bit different. We're both using eight ounces and our, our baits are dragging like kind of close to the boat. So instead of that, I'm gonna throw on a lighter weight, maybe a five ounce and let this drift way back there. My thinking is maybe when the weight is farther away from the boat, the halibut won't be as line shy. So we'll see. What the heck? I was just the same exact thing, bro. Yeah, on I the was turn. trying to bounce it down oh. to the bottom, and we just changed the speed too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man, we had the bucket out there, and then made a turn, and then we haven't gotten a bite for, you know, 20 minutes. Yeah. So we decided to take the bucket out. We made the same turn we did earlier, same spot. <laughs> June bounced same it again. bouncing <laughs> in his hand. He got another fish. Crippled anchovy, bro. Crippled anchovy. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, okay. oh shoot. Right there. Got him. Woo! That's a good yeah. one. That's a good one. That's, that's a good a one. That's a very, very nice one. Crippled anchovy. Let's go. Quick. Let's do that turn again. Yeah, yeah. Man, this herring, you'd think it would be great, but June, two fish on the crippled anchovy? Can't <laughs> argue with that, so I think I'm gonna switch it up too. First, I'm gonna try this bouncing method on this turn. Let's see if this works. Bouncing method on the turn? <laughs> I think the crippled serves as a flasher too, uh, right? I got the pink one. Okay, actually, I have a green one, actually. You wanna yeah. use this? Oh, it's rigged already? Yeah, it's rigged. Oh, it's yes, done. for sure. I'll use that one. Man, that was funny. Exactly the same thing. Same exact thing. We had the bucket, took it off to speed up, did a small turn, and June bounced it like that. Just like that. Got another one. 
Are we turning right now? Oh, I'm gonna catch another one right here. <laughs> Dude, your hook, your treble hook is so small. Small. Yeah. Is this you made this for halibut? For halibut, yeah. You like the small treble hook? Because uh, I get more chances of them swallowing it all the way, uh. and then getting them hooked. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And, and it doesn't affect the uh, spin. So look, this is what we got. One year old anchovy. One year old. Small size. Look how small that is. It barely even fits into the head of this thing. <laughs> Maybe that's what they're on. The small little bait. Small. Yeah. Probably. Because all my herring are big. And they're not biting at all. Okay, and then what do you do? I just put it right there. Like how salmon, we, we rig our salmon. Yeah. All right, we got halibut slayer over here. <laughs> so this is how we're going to rig it. We got one hook through the body of the anchovy, give it a little pull, right? Just a little pull. And we got this treble hook dangling from the back. So if it bites, like that last one, it really got deep into its throat. So we're also going to switch up to an eight ounce. We're going to do exactly the same rig. <laughs> and I'm going to bounce it too. This is how we do it. Bounce it, bounce it. All right, well, we're trying the same method, turning around and slowing down and speeding up and bouncing it but we didn't get anything but I did want to give a shout out to my neighbor Sean who hooked it up with this report I don't know if I can say exactly what he told me but I'll say it anyway because the bite's probably gone he said no I can't say it ah I can't say it <laughs> should I say it I can't say it, say it. all right he said the bite is just north of the flight path what does that mean north of the flight path north of the flight path path mm -hmm. i don't know really we're going south <laughs> yeah <laughs> so the opposite way yeah so that's that's all that we'll tell you north of the flight path oh yeah. so last night i started my fast mm -hmm. this is going to be the fourth time i'm fasting this year I'm trying to do it once every month for the entire year in january i did 48 hours february i did 72 hours March, I did 36 hours. And this time, I think I'm gonna stick with the 36 hours. I kinda of like that. It's like, you have dinner, that first night is no problem. The whole entire next day, you don't eat. And that's when it's tough, the next night, the second night. But then you break your fast in the morning. And I think it has a lot of benefits. So I'm gonna keep doing that. I think I found what's right for me. I just saw some bait jumping right here. You ever wonder about the FDA, June? FDA about what? Like, why are they in control of the food? Oh my And God. also the drugs after the food makes you sick. The drugs after the food the make food, you sick? Food and Drug Administration, right? They make the regulations on the food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They also make the regulations on the drugs. So... Like they, I'm like not they, really sure about that. I don't really, I don't want to say they're having control of everything so they can get more money. <laughs> yeah. I'm um, not saying that, but I'm that so, might be. <laughs> yeah, I'm just more skeptical <laughs> as I get older. <laughs> Seems like it's all connected in some weird way. Not just, <laughs> I don't know, man. I've been feeling a lot like a grumpy old man now lately. Dude, when I was trying to lose weight, yeah. um, my diet is all is protein, yeah. meat, and vegetables. That no carbs good. and that sounds no, good. no sugar at yeah. all. Yeah. That's... And I feel great. Yeah. Like I feel like I can go for 12 rounds. Yeah. And it feels really good. I never get tired. Yeah. Talking about Taekwondo, right? Taekwondo, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah I know. No, that sounds like the best diet you can do. Just cut out the carbs completely. Carbs, no sugar. No sugar. See that pier over there? Yeah. Yeah, never. What is that? That's Highway 92, right? 
That is 92. Yeah, that's 92. Towards Hayward, yeah. San Mateo Bridge. Let's go over that's there. San Mateo Bridge, yeah. Yeah, let's go over there. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's try it out. We got two fish, so we can explore a little bit. Maybe we'll hit a hot let's spot. Let's do it. Let's do it. And burn the spot, maybe. Burn, burn a spot. That's correct. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we do. <laughs> No, it's not. Okay, it's not. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> We're just kidding. All right, here we go. Another spot. See what happens. Ten feet deep. Trolling herring, June's trolling anchovy. I mean, the bay is so huge, right? There's got to be more fish there than just one spot. There should be one more spot. fish. What's your favorite age for your kids? What do you mean? Like teaching? Yeah. No, no. Your own kids. Oh. Like what's your? Do you have a, a favorite? Favorite age for, kids? No, oh, not a kids? not a not a favorite kid. Oh. Like a favorite age. Age, age. Yeah. I think I, for now I only had a six year, uh, a twelve year old. Twelve year old kid. So two year old. From that age to all my little ones, I think I like the like a two to three years old, four. I like that. Yeah. They're sweet. They're so innocent. Play. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like that age. Othniel now he's four. He yeah. turns five in September. He's a little bit more independent now. Yeah. Yeah, I like like two to three, three and a half, four. Even he's, I of course love him now still. Yeah. But, yeah. but when like Rizal, twelve, he's turning twelve. Uh huh. So it's a little different. I like it too because it's he's maturing, mm -hmm. and then you can converse oh. with. Oh. Fish on. Oh. Woo! Go. Yeah, yeah man. Let's, go, let's, go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Feels good, feels let's good. Go, let's go, let's Might be go. small though. Might be small. Oh, that's a good one. You got some weight on it, June. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's taking drag. It's taking some drag. Woo! <laughs> Not even five minutes. No. On this spot where my hat yeah. fell off. June's hat. Oh, you, let's gaff this one. That's gaff. Where's the gaff, bro? Right here. Right there. Yeah, we're driving to the spot. And then June's hat <laughs> fell off. We're like, oh, well, why don't we just try right here? <laughs> and what do you know on a herring, crippled anchovy? Not even a five minute trolling. It might be small. That's, oh, dude, that's a keeper. You think so? That's a keeper. Should I lift we'll him see, into we'll the see. boat? No, we'll you sure? I don't know. I don't uh, know. It's 22. Close. Let's go lift it up. Oh, that's, is he, I don't know. That's a good one. I think that's a keeper, bro. I think so. Oh. You want to lift it up? Yeah, yeah, lift up. Yeah, this is a keeper for sure. Mm, I don't know, it's pretty close. Cool. Yeah, that's 22 and a half. Yeah, 23. Yeah. It's 23. Okay. 23. Yes. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Let's go. All right, all right. <laughs> all right, three on board. I just rubber banded it only. Where's his head? Right there, somewhere. It's a small hook. <laughs> Check for the line for phrase. Looks good. We'll do it again. Oh, you're using the cripple. That yeah, know. I'm using the cripple with I the herring. I you switch it. With the herring. With nope. the herring? I'll, I might switch with herring. Okay. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Nice. That's three. Hey, half limit. Yep, yep. Getting there. Three more. So that's the herring. I'm trying to use the smallest ones I got. And instead of putting the hook through the body, I'm just putting a little rubber band right next to the hook. I don't know, I like it with this crippled anchovy. It spins <laughs> so naturally. And I put a lighter weight on, I did a five ounce. Yeah. All right, let's talk about our kids again. Kids. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for you, right? Cause uh, yep. uh, Sarah is, yep. I'm done too. <laughs> oh, I know, I know. No uh, more for me, no you more. Know, you know Trong, right? Trong, yeah. Yeah, so he, does, he's, he's uh, into Bigfoot a little bit. Big and like foot? aliens and uh -huh, stuff. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So he's he was watching this show. It's called Missing 411. It's about people who go to the national forest and somehow they just disappear. go missing. Yeah, they disappear. Uh -huh. No trace. Like not a killer. It seems almost supernatural. So some people got abducted and they never returned. They never found them, but they found some of their stuff like 10 miles away. Yeah. No tracks. One guy they found and they actually found him and he said the reason that so he said that he got abducted abducted aliens 
<laughs> okay? And so the reason that they brought him back and let him come back was because all the other people, they were trying to get their reproductive organs. So this guy actually had a vasectomy. <laughs> so that's why they took him and then, and then they him. released him <laughs> because they couldn't he... use him. So me and Tron were saying, we're going to use you <laughs> to go tell us what is like on the alien spaceship because they will release you. Yeah. But they will take us and they won't release us. What so about that guy? What did he say <laughs> about, uh, about the alien that he released him? Like, how does it look like there? I want to try it. I'm going to go to that place. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I want to get abducted. <laughs> abducted. <laughs> abducted. All right, well, come to me, to my land, to my land, and we'll go camping. And we'll leave you in the middle of the field. We'll record you. Yeah, I, I make sure I bring my GoPro with me and then document everything. And I'll tell you what happened there. A lot of times when you're fishing for halibut, it seems like, I mean, I don't have that much experience, but it seems like the bite comes from going with or against the current. And a lot of the bites come in the same direction. This bite came going with the current. Right now we're going against the current. I took the drift sock up, but we're gonna turn around and I'm gonna put the drift sock back in so I can replicate the same conditions as when we got that fish just now. Three bites, three fish, all keepers so far. Not a bad day. Not a bad day. Well, take a look at this. Usually I'm under the Golden Gate Bridge or the Bay Bridge, but this is the San Mateo Bridge. I've never been under here. This is the first time. I don't see a lot of water ripping around the pilings. Just give it a shot. See what happens. Yeah, this is nice. Yeah, it's nice. I like it here. Water is murky though. Yeah, very murky. Let's just try here for a bit. Yeah, I know. 10 minutes. Uh huh. Yeah. What do you think? Should we go? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We'll go back to our original spot. I don't know why we left fish. They always <laughs> say, don't leave fish to find fish. But it's always fun to explore. Let's do this, Matt. All right, June, let's do it. I want to take this thing out of the water. I got a bite. Right there. Right there. Oh, okay, fish on. Big oh, one. Good one. Oh, oh there bro, you go. Bro. Big one. Big one. Big one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Third one. Third one. Woo. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh my god, this is a big one, Matt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Taking drag. Third one. Bro, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my god, yeah. On the turn again, on the bouncing. On the turn, on the bounce. Yeah. Let's go. Your line. Your line. Your line. Oh, oh, okay. Let me just bring mine in, huh? It's a big one, yeah? It's a big one. Look. Taking drag. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna run out of line. Oh no, 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 stop it. Are you snapping? Stop the motor. I'm yeah, gonna run turn, out of I'll turn around, I'll turn around. I'll, I'll turn towards it. Put your line over the top. Shoot. Over the top, over the top. I'm bro. running out of line, bro. I'm turn around, turn around. I'm gonna chase it down, I'm gonna chase it down. Oh no, no. Two. Go, 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 go. Real, real, go. real, real, real. Real, 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 real. Oh shoot. Oh, that, dude. Oh no. Oh, shoot. No, 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 no. Don't lose it, June. Oh, no. Oh. Bro. No. Oh. Please, stay in my line. Oh. oh, no. Really? Come on. Oh, yeah, still on, still on. We're still on. Is it fish for sure? Yeah. Is it fish? It's not a snag, yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, bro, this is big. Is it a fish, though? It's a fish. I don't know. Right? It's not snag, huh? I don't think so. Dude, this is a 50 inches right here. <laughs> 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 I 
Yep, yep, it's fighting, bro. What the Take heck? Jack. What the heck? Just a Dude, big, let's go. It could be a white sea bass, bro. Really? I mean, maybe. Could be. Oh my gosh, my heart is really <laughs> pounding oh like crazy right man. now. <sighs> let's go. Let's go. Oh, I thought we were going to lose it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah we're going to go around it. <sighs> what is this? Stingray? Is this thing, uh, I don't know. Hopefully not. Hopefully not. Hopefully not a stingray. Oh, oh my god. Coming towards us. Here we go. If, it's the orange line. If it's 50, I'll gaff it. Dude, whatever, man. Just take this, land this fish. Okay, careful. Let's all let's keep him away from the motor, though. Oh, 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 oh. oh gotta turn, 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 turn. Okay. Oh, this is halibut. This is halibut. The way he just let us. Uh, let me reel the hism. <sighs> yep, this is halibut, bro. The way this guy fighting. Taking drag right now. A yeah. lot of drag. What is this? A shark? I don't know. If it's shark, it probably the line was already broken. True. I hope this is halibut, man. Yeah, I hope so too. Oh my god, my heart is... Woo! We're almost there, bro. But man, look at this. White caps everywhere now. Just oh, in a matter of minutes. I know, it's just all of a sudden, wind picked up. You got a leader? Is that your leader? No, 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 no. It's really close, bro. Oh. Right there. Oh. Right there. Snag. Right there. Snagged on something. No, Albert! No, it's oh, Stingray. Oh, stingray. it's a Stingray, bro. Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Dude! Oh man, that would be awesome if this is a halibut. All right, I'll bring it in, bring it in. It's the biggest thing right right here. Oh man, I don't know how we're gonna get this. That's a huge Oh, thing. that's huge, Bat Ray. If he runs, I'm just gonna let go. Yeah. How are you gonna grab it? I'm gonna try to get the pliers. A little bit that's more. That's humongous right back there. Back up, back up, can you? Back up more. Cut it. No, I got it. Oh, you got it out. Yeah. Wow. On the bouncy, bouncy again. 20 more minutes? No, we gotta go. go. Gonna well, go? It's 108 already. Alrighty. Oh man, it's so bad out here. That was a fun little last stingray. But it's crazy how the conditions can change just like that. Anyway, good day. Good day, Fish Rookie June. Yep. I'm gonna do a halibut popcorn chicken today also. Yeah, I wanna do I wanna make some popcorn chicken out of that. Yeah. Well, alright, so you guys know now it's halibut time. So get out here if you can. Just make sure you get off the water before the afternoon. It always gets windy in the bay. Peace.